catch up, but um, we had a meeting this afternoon, our, our uh, meeting that we've been talking about for uh, the catathon. So I'm a little behind in organizing all this. So give me just a minute here, please. Did the new girl that was returned her mama passed away? So while I saw her, I thought I'd better show her again. She looks a lot like Bella. Yeah, she's fluffy. She's not brown. She's just fluffy. Come on, guys. I see you got a white German Shepherd over there. Isn't that a white German Shepherd? Come on, everybody. Okay, you got a white German we Shepherd got. over there, don't you? Hmm? You got a white German Shepherd over there, don't you? Oh, that's that dog that was. Here is a puppy. And uh, he couldn't keep it, and so he found a friend to take it. But so they come and visit. There you go, Bella. Oh, I think they kind of are there. Yeah. Oh, okay. My God, wasn't that terrible about that girl from Ottawa? About the what? The girl from Ottawa. Well, yes. Drowned in my back. Yes. I guess it just gives me the heebie jeebies back and just to think of the horror, of the horror and panic and fright that poor child yeah. must have felt. Yeah. That the only thing that I said, I'm not, I'm not pointing any fingers. I just feel very, very sorry for her. I bet her mother probably has to have a sedative to sleep because she can probably only see that in her mind and that girl was frantically. Hi everybody, we are ready to start. There we go, there's a clue for you. Hi everybody. Do we have somebody that will will be our cat tonight? Just a second, Jackie. Just let me yeah. see the cat. I'll have to find it, but yes. Come on, get down here and eat. The <sighs> purse tonight. Please open Dilo's first, okay? Maybe how are our boxes? Come on, Do we me. have a hi? Hi everybody! Hi everybody! It's good to have you here. Oh, and Tiger Bright! I love it. I, I hear so many. I see so many names. I know. Um, turn up the bot volume. Yep. Is that a little bit better? And I can talk louder too. Oh, oh, I missed that. Okay, Nuki, you're you're on for the category. Okay, and is the voice okay? <laughs> okay, we are ready. Let's find Tilo first, though. Um, where did it go? Where did it go? Hang on. Oh my goodness, where did it go? Not a gene. Somebody out there, come here and help me find Tilo's box. I just had it, but oops, this is um drugs too. Well, not drugs, but meds for the clinic. Back by the washer? No, that one's got medicine in it for the our clinic. Okay, let's do this. Not that one. Not this one. That one's the Adagene. I know I saw Tilo. 
Oh, oh, here it is. Here it is. Okay, Nuki, if you're ready, I'm ready. You, <laughs> I'm telling you, you guys don't miss a beat out there. This is from Harrison, Ohio. And it's from a retail resource. And it's for Tilo. Tilo! He was usually Tilo. I was just sitting with Tilo at my desk, and he, of course, was playing games with me. That's their magazine. These are it. These are it. These are those plastic rings that Tilo goes crazy about. Now we got, you know, uh, Connie had sent some plastic things the other day and milk rings and with these this is exactly what so we are in good shape this is what they are yep, look at that he ought to have enough to last him for a little while Tito. there he goes there he goes I'll give him two <laughs> no problem. Thank you, thank you. You guys have made Tilo's day. And we're going to have crashing of the boxes here in just a minute. Tilo, you're lucky. He's carrying one around in his mouth. Thank you for that. You know, you guys are pretty cool. It's nice that you guys care enough about these kitties when they have a special need like that. I didn't know where to find any more. Stacy had been trying to find some, but she had... She uh, had ran out of her source, too, so that's pretty cool. Yes, I have way too much help some nights. This one is from, see, I never know if it's really that person or not, so we'll just say the town for right now, Lafayette, Tennessee. And it's not a real heavy box. Looks like a, it sounded like a fun box, I thought. Oh, it's got this on top. Look at that. Aww. Oh my goodness. What is that? Oh, look at this. All these kitties. Oh, are they little magnets? No. Oh, they have glued on there. Isn't that cute? Oh my gosh. Huh. Look at this, Dean. Steve says amazing, and it is. Look at that. These are 3D kitties up there. Has her address. This is a sack I'm going to save. Isn't that cool? Meow, oh, meow, meow. Here, kitty, kitty. Fancy feline. Perfect. F this is really cool. Oh, 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 oh. Reese's Pieces. Pam, what's your favorite kind of candy? Chocolate. Chocolate. <laughs> As she says it with it in her mouth. This says, this is from Beverly G. This is from Beverly G. Just a note to let you know what is enclosed in the box. I made you a bag. I don't know if you remember, but I made Hannah's for Christmas. I wondered. Beverly, when I saw this, I wondered if this might be from you, too. In the bag, you will find a card for your mother and one for Peggy S. And I could never send a box and not put something in for all the wonderful cats. I so love you and all the cats. You have saved me from being a crazy old lady with a hundred cats. My father tells me all the time I have too many cats. I tell him there is always room for one more. Right. So hoping that this summer I get to come and visit you and all the cats. My father asked how many cats I plan to bring home. Is there a limit? Ha ha. Once again, thank you for all you do and sharing it with the world. Beverly G. Isn't that cool? And we have toys. Oh, this is, this is a different toy. This is a swat and swipe toy. You know what? In the door that goes into the office, we can actually um, use that for. Oh, you, whoops. Do you want it now, Tori? Oh, look, and we got, oh, this is a, 
a catnip cat dancer. You know those cat dancers that we have? That's what this is, but there's a... Oh, look at that. You can put that cat on the tip of that cat dancer. Those are cool. We'll have fun with that. And here's the two cards. And look how beautiful they are for Peggy and my mom. And, oh, wow. Whoa. Check this out. You guys all know what we do with these. These are those, um, uh, 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 paw points that we get free litter from. Pets rock. Oh, emery boards. Oh, that is that cute for what? And then there's another eek toy. Hey, look at that, Holly. And we've got some more of those um, dental ones from Pet Stages. And those are always fun. Anything with feathers and some, and some um, kitty treats. So thank you. This is pretty cool. This is way more than pretty cool. You know, with all the... Um, all the points, the poll points that we've gotten this week, we should be getting some more coupons. They send us those coupons for um, the free litter. So I think that we will be able to get them again real soon. And uh, so Beverly, thank you. I love the bag. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep the bag. I think that's pretty cool. So thank you. And the toys. And we can probably. Yeah, we'll put the kitty food right in here because I know Pam uses some on her Wednesday night for her for when she goes out and does the sun porch and uh, kitty city kitties. Okay. Oh, yeah, there's some more in there. Oh. I know what you're trying to do. Yeah. All right. Pretty cool. We'll put I'll put this up on the door tonight. Okay, I gotta try to stay a little neat. I always get so. Sloppy. This one is for Ada Jean. Do we know where Ada Jean is, Pam? No. Uh, I'm not going to put the farm myself. I wonder if she's up here. Yep. Here, I'll show her through the cam and then I'll let you feed her. Isn't it funny how we know where a lot of these pets are because they're such creatures of habit. They, they sleep in their areas. You got a box. I think it's a Valentine box. Oh, she's she's an old girl, isn't she? We love her. Here you go, Pam. Here you go. Why don't you go with Pam? I thought that was pretty cool the other night. All the Valentine cards that the kitties got. That we were. I think we found in every kitty that got one but one. This is to add a Jane. Where did I get this oh, time? Where that? I'm just a cat and we'll get get along fine. As you remember, I'm not yours, you're mine. Hi, Ada Jane. You are now completing your sweet 16th year. And on Friday, we'll start the, the sweetest 17th year. She does. She's got a birthday. She's happy. Then. Oh, happy, happy birthday. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that is nice so that. nice. This is oh, nice this is from Gloria and Linda from Atlanta, Georgia. That's you. She says, you guys all fuss about Cutter. You forgot to fuss on me. Thank you. Know. Thank you. This Gloria and Linda, I appreciate the support you've shown us over the time. And let's see what they sent for Ada Jean. And that you remembered her birthday. Oh, this is a box of yums. We got whiskers. Oh, whisker licking. Do you need something for her? I just want my hair. Oh, okay. And Here now. the beloved chicken breast. Here now. This is what um, Ada Jean and uh, Twinkle has been eating. And uh, boy, if I can get anything for Twinks to eat, I'll we'll do it. I'm sure Ada Jean will share. And two appetizers. Oh, and these are the treats that Ada Jean likes, too. Oh, I think I remember you asked me about some of the things that, that Ada Jean likes. Thank you. Thank you so much. 
you know, we weighed we weighed some of the kitties this morning, and uh, whew, I knew that um, this is cool. Thank you. These, these are all the things that added to my life. Uh, we weighed some of the cats this morning, and oh my goodness, last week I knew it was kind of tough on Twinks, Twinkles, and she did. She lost. She's lost over a pound. But that didn't happen just last week. She had started the week before not eating as much. So we just feed her as much as she wants. And we'll probably um, have our vet, when she comes in here fairly soon, do uh, uh, some tests on her. I know we want to do maybe the thyroid on her. Badu is stand sitting up there staring at me. Oh, my. This one is heavy. And this is from Linnell, L-I-N-E-L-L, -L -L, and Mark. And excuse me just a minute, because I think I have a paper from them. Uh oh. Yep, this is from Linnell. And uh, she said. There's something breakable in it. I hope it gets to you safely. Oh, me too. It, you packed it really, really good, now. I can tell. And I didn't hear any anything um, that crinkled in here. Oh, look at this. Oh, my gosh. Mm. Look at this. This is another packet like that one. Wow. It says, read me first. I love it when I get directions. I love that. Dear Jackie and volunteers, Hello, my name is Linnell. I am also known as Linnell37 on chat. You may see me signed in, but I don't really chat that much because I am a little shy. I have two dogs named Gypsy and Angel, or as I call her, Monkey. I also have a mini lock named Suki and one cat named Freedom, who I call Munchkin. I love all animals. I grew up with dogs my whole life, and we have always got our pets from shelters. We just finally got a kitten last year, and I just adore her. So She is so much fun. I have only been watching your site for about a month and a half. I really enjoy watching all the kitties play and sleep. It brings so much joy to my life. I really enjoy how you and all the volunteers include us in your everyday life, whether it is just saying hi or bringing us a kitty to see, telling us updates on the center, or how a kitty is feeling that day. I have never felt so included in my life. You are really, you all really do make me feel like I am, I am part of your family. That's why we do it. We, we want you, we want you all to feel you're a part of what we do here. To show you my appreciation, I want to just do something for you. I have written a little something for you. If you look real close at it, you can see that I colored each letter and paw print by hand. It took a little while and a few tries, but I wanted it to be perfect because in my eyes, you are all worth the time and effort. I really hope you enjoy it and share it with the chatters, friends, and family. I usually do this type of writing for friends and family, and because I consider you my family, I wrote it just for you. Thank you, Linnell. Thank you for bringing me into your family. I also thought of this. Hope you like it. FFRC is the place to be if you need a home and a comfy place to sleep, to fill your tummy and clean you up for all to see, then stop on by to FFRC. Linnell, thank you. Thank you. That is very, very nice. And uh, Tilo is probably looking for his rings and getting into this. Look at this. There's kitty toys. Oh, pictures to share. Let's do these first here. Oh, these are her babies. Are you, are you all right? I do. Be careful. <laughs> Here is Munchkin. Oops, no it isn't. I'm sorry. I made a mistake. Yeah, Munchkin worked very hard for her $10. Uh -huh. Munchkin's favorite place to sleep. Oh, boy. She's passed out. Gypsy, Monkey, and Munchkin watching their new friend very closely. Aw, that's very nice. Look at that. I love it how the cam picks up your pictures. Oh, and here's your bunny. Suki sharing her home with Munchkin. Isn't that neat? Remember Kathy? She always would bring her...
guinea pig over and the cats were nice to it. Aww. Uh -huh. Looking out the window. Angel or I, or as I call her monkey in freedom, aka munchkin, looking outside for chipmunks. Gypsy is our five-year-old golden retriever lab. Freedom is being her silly self sitting on my stool. Aw, this is so cute. Suki, my mini lot beer bunny. She loves to drink out of the doggy water bowl. See, isn't that nice? They can all get along. That's pretty cool. I like that. Thank you, Linnell, for sharing those. I'll stick these up on our our uh, wall down here, too, with, with your letter. And this is to all the FFRC kitties. You guys, great here. Caught you. Thought you, there you go, stealing hearts again, especially mine. To all my new friends at FFRC, you always bring a smile to my face. Happy Valentine's Day, Linnell. We'll put that up on our card of walls, too, Linnell. And this is for Peggy. And this is for my mama. So I will stick those there. And I will keep organized tonight. Um, there is all kinds of treats. There's whisper licking. There's the party, party mixes. There's all flavors in here. And whiska, whiska tubs and the appetizers. Wow, Linnell, you packed a little bit of everything in here for the kitties. And I see something else down there, too. There's some more soft food. Gravy sensations, which you... The kitties really like the gravy sensations. Now, come on. You can't get into that. Badu is trying to tell Tilo. Oops, no, that's not Tilo, that's Plymouth. Badu, come on. She ju he just wants to pass by. Oh, oh. <laughs> Little rascal. It's okay. You were reading Badu right there, buddy. The box is just full of... There's some more toys. Look at all these. These are all different colors. multi -pet. And those are those loofah ones. Oh, my gosh. Oh, look at that. Could somebody take a screenshot so we can put that up? Really, really cool. I'll read that. It says, we love you for taking us into your home. We love you for keeping us safe from harm. We love you for keeping us warm from the cold. We love you for keeping our tummies full. We love you for letting us rule the center. We love you for helping us find our future, our forever homes. Whether we stay or go to our forever homes, we will always be grateful to you for loving us just the way we are. We can never thank you enough for everything you do for us. You will remain in our hearts for eternity. Love and always and forever. Kitties from FFRC. Linnell, thank you. Look, this is the one she said she painted or did each individual. That's really nice. Thank you. Thank you, Linnell. We will, we will hang this up in the rescue center. And I am going to put this down here. Because we'll hang it tomorrow and I don't want it broke. Linnell, you're pretty cool. Thank you so much. Very, very much for that. And you guys, now listen, we're supposed to not get all the toys out at one time and don't hurt the bag. Don't hurt the bag. Here, did you want this toy? Here, go ahead. Thank you, Linnell. That's pretty cool. Boy, we've got really cool boxes here tonight again. I always say I'm going to keep organized. And somehow or another, I don't make it. This is uh, from Francis at R. Francis R. from Illinois. I tried to shake this. It sounded like cereal, so I think I wasn't probably very right on that. You know, my sister Judy was here today. She stopped in. And um, Badu usually kind of is picky with her a little bit. 
But she was all over Judy. It was so sweet. Oh, this package is for Shasta. And Shasta was adopted today. So I got a, uh, it was either an email or a phone call said to uh, make sure that I do get into this. And I, and I had said that we will go ahead and hang up the card. Yeah, I was told there was a card. Happy birthday, happy Valentine's Day, Shasta. We're still going to put it up. Look at that. That's, that's a cool one. You made that one. Dear Shasta, sending my favorite rescue center kitty lots of love this Valentine's Day. I know how much you love your food. Oh, hey boy, is that an understatement. So here's three bags of treats for you to enjoy. Make sure to share with all your other kitty friends too. I hope you have a great Valentine's Day and get lots of love from everyone at the rescue center. Um, there's a chance that they might stop by, uh, the people that adopted Shasta, or, yeah, Shasta. So, if so, I will make sure that they see Shasta's card. That's pretty cool. And look at this. There's little posty notes, which you know we use a lot, and some more treaties for the kitties. Oh, one of each kind. Yeah, I did send some treats home with Shasta, and I did send the roundy thing, the trackball thing that Shasta likes, too. So she went to a really cool home. The young man that adopted her was just thrilled. And he picked her out on Pet Finders and said that that was the one that he had wanted. And, you know, a lot of times when people come in, they change their mind after they see everybody else. But he didn't. He wanted Shasta, and that's the one that he kept. And what are you doing? There's Toreen. Okay, and this one, I'm not positive, but I think this might be from Madison Peeper. Maybe, because I know this is from Petco. And this, if it is from Madison, let me double check here. I think it, I think it is. Wow. Check this out. Yeah, it is. These remember Madison and her family just got a um, her her fur kid just got a new new family member it says uh, these are from our new family member six month old orange tabby Christmas remember that's when she just got her or he he had his rear leg amputated on 12:30 after being rescued from a New York City kill shelter where he was he is amazing. Sweet, loving, and can he run fast? We love him. Was found injured on Christmas Day, and we adopted him on January 22nd from Madison Pepper and the Fur Kids. And we have really cool stuff here, too. These are, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, six boxes of the Fancy Feast appetizers. I'm telling you, if you guys have old cats that won't eat very good or kitties that have been sick and just need some appetite starters, these appetizers will do it. Um, all, of, all of our oldsters love these, and it's just been the biggest help for us. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to set those in there and just take the box back. Thank you, Madison. And Madison, I'm so happy that you got your kitty. I love the picture that you sent, or that you posted of him. <laughs> I buy these. I don't think you can see. Badu is right here to my right, doing what she does best. What she does best, hanging over the edge on the shelf. She just she puts shelves or counters or whatever clear up here to her chest and then she just hangs right over. Okay, this one is from Walmart. I think I had gotten a paper on Walmart but that somebody sent something from Walmart so maybe something is inside. Ooh, lots of stuff. Let me go check my wall and 
Let me just go check real quick. Yeah, I got it. A lot of times I can't, I have trouble matching them up because I don't have a lot of clues how to put them together. But this one, yep, is this one. This is from Siggy Surfing. Um, Sincerely Smokey's Mom, Siggy Surfing. And these are a few items that came from Walmart to help. And there's a lot of cool items in here. The Fancy Feast. The Sensitive Tummy. This is a, the adult one for the cat. Whoa! Come here, Jacob. Come here, Jacob. There you go. You want some help? There you go, big boy. And also, the eyes, the adult. And we mix this stuff all together. So these two things will be a good addition for the dry food. Clorox wipes. We use these a lot. A lot, a lot. Yep, this is from Siggy. Um, you know, we've had a few bouts of sickness with the humans, with the volunteers that's here, but, you know, every day, a couple times a day, we go through and wipe things and wipe doorknobs off and the phones and things like that. And I think it's really helped this year to kind of keep that flea bug away. And some of the Fancy Feast medleys. And last but not least, a great big giant bag of the Mega Temptations. Thank you, Siggy. Thank you very much. And uh, give your little Smokey a big hug for me. And I'll put this over here. What are you guys doing over there? Here, do you want that? Do you want that? Tilo? Um, here, Tilo. <laughs> you're, you're just way too helpful, buddy. I think what's in here is I had another box from Walmart also, and these are also from Siggy Surfing. And uh, I was just going to say, I think Siggy's from Florida, and yes, she is. Um, this has first a toy in it for the kitty, which is their bag. They, or their um, brown paper wrapping, which we'll put out tonight for them. And there's also a 20-pound bag of bitter. And uh, there was another box that also came at the same time. And the box broke because of the weight. So I went ahead and kept that back there because it was really heavy. And it was also two more boxes of um, Arm & Hammer kitty litter. So thank you, Siggy. Now we can feed them. I always say if we get if they get food, we gotta gotta give them litter too. Tweeny is she's doing so much better. Her paws just a little bit sore yet. It's the swelling is all gone. Uh, she wants out now. Now she's telling me it's time. Quit babying me. No, no, not yet, Tweeny. So thank you, Siggy and Smokey. I appreciate that very, very much. See now, that's open, that's open. This one isn't. This is from Lillian. And I can't quite, oh, here we go. No, nope, it's from Whitney H. Oh, from Cincinnati, Ohio. Whitney H. From Cincinnati. Sam, yeah. look, at, look at her. She's... <laughs> Yeah, I'm quite a <laughs> She's so funny. Look at that. How old is she? She, um, I think we got her down. I'd have to look. She's oh. just a couple, I believe. I'd have to look. She's a crabby Sometimes I can't keep them all straight on the knee. She's or on the thing. She is beautiful. She don't have any teeth in her, does she? Uh, she came in as a supposedly full bred. They, uh, uh Ragdoll. They bought her oh. from a common freezer. Why did they turn her in? Uh, moved. Couldn't keep her. She's gorgeous. She is. Says, my name is Whitney, and I am from Cincinnati. I have been watching the cam for a while now and chat occasionally, 
and her chat name is Witster XO. It's W H I T S T E R X O. I just graduated in December with my master's. Congratulations. And I start my new job in the middle to end of February. I plan on regularly giving to FFRC once I have a steady income. Thank you, Whitney. In the meantime, I sent a couple things that my meager bank account would allow. I hope the kitties enjoy them. The balls are, are my K Cali kitten's favorite toys. I made the blanket years ago, and it has just sat in my closet since then. I figured the kitties might enjoy it. It's a big one, so feel free to use it wherever or however you like. Thank you for all that you and the volunteers do. Until next time, Whitney. P.S. In about a year or so, once I have saved up some money, I plan on moving out of my parents' house and getting my own place. I will be looking to FFRC to provide me with a furry friend or two to keep me company. Whitney, that would be cool. That's why I'm I'll have to, I'll get that later. It's not my mom. Whitney, thank you. So let's see. What Whitney said. Oh, this will be fun. Oh, you're right. You're right. This will be fun. This is Boots and Barkley Cozy Climber Cat Toy. There's a picture of it there. Check that out. Yeah, Farrah, we got to give her her meds. Isn't that cool? This will be fun. Um, Whitney, I'm going to probably put this together tomorrow or the next day, and we will get this out for the kitties. This will be fun for them. It's got a, looks like a soft area on the bottom to lay on, too, in addition to climbing on top, so that will be fun for them. Wow, you guys hit the jackpot in snackers today, and Scrunchy Bunch, we put all those snacks in our, uh oh Hang on. I just noticed that. You really <laughs> cool. The door didn't get shot shut properly. And guess who's here? Tweeny says, is my mommy out there? You are a rascal. You're supposed to still be on cage rest. Yes, your doctor vet said cage rest. All right, yeah, you squirted out of there as fast as could be. Here, you just move. Come on, watch your head. Give them an inch and they take a mile, just like a kid does. Um, so these crunchy toys, we've had, we've only gotten these a couple of times. These are kind of cool. I don't know what it is about them, but they, they like to carry them around in their mouths. We're going to get you fear here in just a few minutes. And here's the blankie. This looks like this will fit right in here with us. These are color. Look at these colors. This is really nice. Wow. Whitney, thank you. We love colors here. Isn't that awesome? I do too. I love these colors. And this is of that same material that um, we get. Blinky's made out of that uh, felt, or oh, what do you call that? It's, it's not like a felt, but it's that stuff that's real easy to um, wash and dry. Just takes a little, little bit of time. And it's, <laughs> and it's pink on the back. Thank you, Whitney. Yeah, guaranteed the kitties will like this. This will, this will be well used. And this, along with those others, will be. They just wash up beautifully. We'll just set this right over here, and I'll I'll put that up so we can use it tomorrow. And okay, where's there we go. We have oh this is from our friend Dorothy Y. Dorothy Y. She's from California. I will always always remember Dorothy because. She's one of the first people that ever called me during the night, and it was because Farah was having a full-fledged um, seizure 
right down here, and Dorothy called. That was that was quite some time ago. Wow, look at this. Okay, we got one for Peggy for her birthday. I'll take that in. Whoops. Oh, one for Steve. You know what? Steve has Steve has gotten a big kick out of all these envelopes that come to him. He can't quite figure it out how people that he hasn't met yet are so kind enough to do that. And this is for my mama. I'll give that to her. I'm saving them all for her birthday. And please give to the little girl volunteer, Libby. She said she was having more surgery. Dorothy, thank you. I will do that. She will be here Friday. And uh, I will make sure she gets that. I Greg got one today, too. Oh, I wanted to mention that. Greg, Greg had received... Um, I think I can put my finger right on it. Let me look here. This one. Greg received a donation in memory of his cat, little girl, from Patty P. from uh, Ohio. And he was very touched by that. I think there was, he, we've gotten a few donations in for his little girl. And I, he was pretty, uh, pretty, thought that was pretty cool that people would do that. We've got another really cool looking package and this is from our from our friend Jim. My granddaughter saw this and she was pretty impressed with all these stamps. Look at that. They're all a uh, heart that they love on them because it's Valentine's Day coming up. What do you think, huh? Oh my goodness, wow, this is def oh <laughs> uh, this is cute. This is for Ernestine. And it's the Crave Crave um goodies, the snackers. <laughs> A kitty with a sucker in front of the nose. It says Ernestine, forever stuck on you. We just love you, Jim and Gan Gary, Blondie, Zoe, Little Bit, and Jim's mom. When Jim comes, sometimes she brings her mom here with her, and we always love to have her. And speaking of moms, my sister Judy brought my mom in today, and um, she really wanted to see the floor. So I thought that was pretty cool. This is for Gramanique. And this one is Valentine. You've got mail. Gramanique, sending wishes for a Valentine's Day that delivers lots of love and laughter. You are very loved. Such a lovely kitty. And this is from Jim and I in the game also. Boy, you guys, you guys did, you guys made out here like bandits on snackies today. I did. She's supposed to stay in for the night. Oh, I think we'll get up Yeah, sorry. This is for Buffy. Do you guys remember where Buffy lives? I know you guys do. Happy Valentine's Day. Hoping all the all the love you give will come right back to you. Buffy is one of our um, Kitty City kitties. Even though we don't see you, we love you just the same. Dear Buffy, aw, Jim, and the game. You know, um, I've got, we've got what I call now our Hall of Fame, uh, our Hall of Cards down there. And uh, I've got them all hanging up there, what we've received so far. And the, vol and the volunteers, and um the visitors that we have have really been having fun uh, reading them. And I have a great place to recycle them at. I found a, uh, one of our volunteers does some really cool stuff with cards. So uh, she's going to help me do something. Or she's going to do something with them. This is for Riza. <laughs> Look at that. As, as love stories go... You are such a wonderful kitty, Raza. Ours is a classic. We love you.
about no it's me it's my card and then when you close it up that person just closed the wind closed the envelope i have had so much fun with that i've been showing everybody that card this is for honey and honey is another sun porch kitty oh check that out that's pretty cool i like that Honey, we wish we could see you best, but we love you just the same from Jim and the gang. Honey is uh, is our black and white cat. and It's got black and white hearts on there. Okay. Oops. And last but not least, this is Simone. So Jim and her gang picked the almost and Raza, Raza kitty lives in here. But the rest of the kitties, I believe, were all sunflower. Uh, no, all kitty kitties, I think. Oh, look at this one. Yeah, we give treats to everybody. Simone. And Simone is that uh, dark tiger, and he's got one eye. And when he came, oh, my goodness, he was so beat up. There's something extra special about Valentine's Day, extra special you. We are sorry we can't see you. But you are loved. Isn't that wonderful? We do show them every once once in a while. And when we move move them from city, Kitty City to Cat's Cold, you guys have been able to see them too, which is always fun. Okay. I think. Oh, I had. Uh-oh. Where did I? Oh, here it is. Uh-oh. Twinkle, what are you doing up here? Here. Here. Here, Twinks. Twinkle. Here. Do you want to stay? You can stay. There we go. This one is, oh, this is from Caroline. Carolyn. She's our friend CJ. Who's in that box? Carolyn's been with us. I think from the beginning of our existence on new screen. I do believe. Oh, and uh, Nuki, if you could put that there's a donation from CJ. Says, I was going through some old pictures and came across these. Yes, I know they were bad girls, but you couldn't help laughing at them. They loved to chase each other down the hall at breakneck speed and then the one in front would fly up the grass cloth wall covering. Usually they hung on until either Lou or I would rescue the climbers. Hope some others can identify with my bad girls. Hate to think I was the only one with wall climbers. I surely do miss these two. Hope you get a chuckle out of them. And this is from Carolyn or CJ Cat. Oh my goodness. Now I see what you're talking about. Oh. Look at that, right up the wall. This one here is Jazz. <laughs> and there's Tabby. Yeah, they're right there on the wall. Isn't that, isn't that cute? I like that. Yeah, that grass. What did you call that, CJ? The grass cloth wall covering. Man, these cats in here would go crazy over that. Thank you, CJ. And I'm going to put that right in here so I can put your your kitty pictures with um, with your letter to hang up. And thank you. And Nuki, if you could put that, there was a donation on there, too. I appreciate it. Oh, Vera, be careful. Uh, I did cover... The B and the E, we got new ones today. They are covered with our tape, but we changed color so they would show up maybe a little bit better too. And this is from, oh, our friend Tom P. from New Jersey. Take time to do what's important on Valentine's Day. Oh, I, I had this one. I like this. Change my litter. Pet me. Feed me. 
get out that feathery thing on a stick. Give me some catnip. Fill up my water dish. Scratch behind my ears. Rub my belly, please. Oh. oh. They made me do it, Tom. Happy Valentine's Day. This is signed from a whole, whole bunch of kitties from here. Tom, they talked you into that, didn't they? That's pretty cool. Thank you, Tom. I like that. Pav, Pocus, Georgia, Twinkle, Georgia, Cutie, Cutie, or Queen Bella, Queen Bella, yes. Patty Cakes, Asha. <laughs> Thank you, Tom. We'll hang this up too on our wall. Aren't those a bunch of cards there, Pam? Yeah, I'm talking, talking to you. See, they talk to you. This one is for County, and I saw County a little bit ago. He was way on the other side, sleeping way up at the top in a blankie. And this is from um, from New Zealand, our friend Kiwi Nams. And it says, County, guess who loves you today? Same person who loves you every day, but today you get a card. Isn't that cute? Oh, I like that. Um, for County, happy Valentine's Day. And there's lots of love and kisses on it. Oh, <laughs> oh thank you, Kiwi. That's cute. We'll get that one hung up, too. Pam's back there looking at them right now. Oh, there's so many. Oh, there it is. Isn't yeah. that fun? Well, you can often say that too. Wow, they're all so pretty. They are pretty. Every single one is just as pretty as the next. Hi there. This one is also from Kiwi, and this is, boy, I can't hit anything today. This is for Cliff. Cliff is another one of our, well, actually, Cliff is a Sunport kitty. Valentine. Some people have money. Some people have looks. Some people have talent. But you're really lucky. <laughs> Thought it was a trick card. You've got me. Oh, happy Valentine's Day with love from a devoted fan. Have only seen a photo of you, but love you just the same from Kiwi. Uh, Ki or, uh, Cliff is one of our Sun Porch kitties. And uh, he's uh, yellow and white, and he's, you rarely see it in cats, but he's actually got a cleft lip, which is why we named him Cliff. But it's only his lip, it doesn't go in his palate, so he, he does just fine. But he's very unmistakable. And if you want to see a picture of him, go to our website, and under the sun porch and... Uh, yeah, just I think we got a label just Sun Porch Kitties. He's he's on there. He's a beauty. This one is for Peverly. Aww. This is more than just a card to say Happy Valentine's Day. It's also a long distance hug. Peverly, I love you lots. If I could have a kitty, it would be you. Love, love, love from Nancy Pants. Nancy Pants, thank you. You know, it's so nice. I recognize so many of you all's names. Yeah, that's really cool. This is from Mary B. in California. Mary B. in California. Whoops, wait a minute. I don't want to... Let me do this so I don't rip that part of it. I'm not sure what this is. Oh, coupons. Oh, Mary, I think you were the one that asked me about coupons. Let me tell you about this. <laughs> yeah, there's all. Oh, and you've got them sorted. Oh, my gosh, that's so nice. For your doggy friends. Oops. There's all kinds here. Oh, even snackies. Uh, this is cool. Okay, you know what? This is funny because just today I was talking to Diane, M, our volunteer, and we do get a lot of uh, we do get a lot of coupons. And I don't, I can't always use all of them, but trust me, as many coupons as I can, I use them. 
because we're all about saving money. And pardon? There's a boy in bolt fall. Oh, really? In yeah. there? There's more? Oh, Pam just brought an envelope full of coupons, too. And today we got uh, two other people brought in a few. So Diane is going to take it upon herself to organize these. She's going to find something that's kind of big that we can hang down from a, a door and label them all and then distribute them in their categories. And that way, when we need them for the rescue center, we can find them. But also, we're going to tell the volunteers that um, they are welcome to to take those too, so that they can share in this goodness also. Hi, you. And this is for Siri. This is from Cheryl, and Cheryl's our friend from Washington. Siri, where are you? She's usually right over there. Oh, oh, Cheryl, you even put a picture. Look at that. It's got her picture on there. Categories for coupons. That's pretty cute, ABQ. Says so, Siri, happy Valentine's Day, baby girl. You are such a gorgeous girl, and I have fallen in love with you. You have found a special place in my heart, and if it was possible, I would have made the long journey to FFRC to bring you home to be my very special baby girl. I'm so glad you are going to a new forever home, but I will miss you terribly. Be well, baby. Be happy and live a long, happy life and loving life with your new forever family. I love you. You melt my heart with your sweet face and your Lion King stands while waiting for your breakfast. God bless you, Cheryl Larson. Cheryl, thank you. You know, when her new mama comes, um, I'll have to show her this. That's cool. Thank you, Cheryl. Just one thing before. Yeah. That kitty, that kitty over there, uh, Chinese on there. Mm -hmm. Bring it in. Mm -hmm. She's got to go in. Okay. She did. Okay. Okay. She's going tomorrow. We'll get a school sample and send it in tomorrow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Not bad, blood. Oh, this is from poor Duncan. Came from Oregon, Ohio. From oh, this is from Diet Dunnikan, as you know. Um, oh, I just saw this too. Dunnikan's a cutie. Look at the all the stickers on that. To hi Dunnikan. Hope your Valentine's Day is filled with fun and love. Oh, oh, look what look what Diet did. Oh gosh, look. Here's Nikki. That I'm betting is a cat. And Sailor in green paw print. And then this one here is Coco. Much bigger. Dia, thank you for sending that. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I like that. No, you can't come up. I haven't done those paw print letters for a little while. I'll have to do those again myself for the kitties here. Oh, this is from you. And I think this is from Dia also. Um, Mew, if for those that don't know, is aww, um, is uh, one of our sun porch kitties. <laughs> Check this kitty out. And it says, uh, Teddy knows what it is like to be busy. He's always flat out. <laughs> aww, you are beautiful, Mew. We love you. Wish you a perfectly happy, dreamy Valentine's Day. And look, we've got the paw prints again. Yeah, that took some time to do that. Thank you. I, I know I love the homemade stuff too. I just love cards. They're, they're fun. This is for Sylvan. And Sylvan is one of the cats, cold cats. Oh, I do. You're okay. Or Kitty City. Kitties. Oh, I've seen this one. This one is so doggone cute. I love that one right on the nose. Um, this is for Sylvan, and this is from Diet. Diet, you must have had green and pink and black everywhere. Isn't that cute? And so Sylvan is our gray tiger, or I tell him he's my silver boy out there. He's a silvery gray kitty tiger. 
Oh, I forgot to do something today. And this is for Preakness. Diet's yeah, been busy. I wonder if you had help, Diet, holding all your critters to do this. Oh, <laughs> love you, Preakness. And check out this. That looks like some FFRC kitties. I can't wait to get all these hung up. We'll have our other whole side filled up. Okay. It's the perfect day to let you know I do appreciate you so for all the loving, caring things you do. The way you pamper pet and feed me and so obviously need me it makes me glad that I adopted you happy Valentine's Day with much love all your feline babies my kitties were really into telling everybody this year isn't that cute thank you thank you somebody you guys talked somebody into helping you didn't you Baju you are all over the place girl and last but not least, this is from Cheryl from Washington. Are you okay there, Tweet? Are you okay there? Aww, check that out. That deserves an awe. It says, Happy Valentine's Day to someone who always knows how to make me smile. What a blessing to be able to watch the cam day in and day out. I love watching the breakfast time. Mostly, oh, mostly your morning arrival. It warms my heart to see how much you love these kitties and how much they love you. Thank you for sharing your passion with us. Also for sharing your good time and your bad as well. I love that you are a real person and put your feelings up for all of us to see and join in with. Thank you for your transparency. You are such a special person and such a blessing to so many. I pray God continues to bless you and give you peace and comfort. Thank you for being such an awesome person and friend. God bless you. Cheryl, thank you. That means a lot to me, especially today. Thank you. Um, that's our last one. And I just wanted to give you a couple updates here. Um, <clears throat> Siri, we're going to have two visitors this weekend. Oh, hang on, I got to catch something here. Mm -hmm. All right. I had um, mentioned that Siri's mama is coming from Minnesota, Minnesota, to adopt Siri, and she's also bringing uh, what, another webcammer who they've discovered a friendship, uh, and they don't live very, very far from each other, both from Minnesota, and that one is Deb one 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 one, and so they're both coming here Saturday for Siri's adoption. And uh, I'm just thrilled about it. I'm just really happy. So pretty cool. Um, also, Siri is going to make a trip. I haven't even got to tell Sarah's new mama this. She's going to make a trip to uh, the vets tomorrow morning. Uh, Martha L. is going to come by in the morning about 10 till 8 in the morning. And um, take her to the vets. And she's going to have her teeth done. So, so, <sighs> so tomorrow, um, Siri's going to be at the vet, and then I'll I'll probably be the one to go pick her up. Although I got to take my mom to a doctor appointment too. So uh, Siri's going to have a sparkling clean pretty teeth look for her new mom. Also, Shasta was adopted this morning. Uh, this one, this really nice fella came in. I had not talked to him before, but we did all, everything uh, here while he was here, his checks and everything. And he passed with flying colors. 
he did also run into the, I gave him the papers that we, we hand out, and he went into town and bought a whole slew of things for Shasta. Very, very excited about having Shasta in his home. Um, you know, I saw something on there uh, about a box from Amazon, was it? Let me take a quick look here. There it is. Amazon boxes from from yeah, let me check here. Maybe I missed something. Then I did have one little thing to say. Hang on. Guess what I found behind the door? good balance. Oh, this is nice also. And this is from Jill R. This is from Jill R. Jill R 27. Oh, here. You know what? Let me, let me take you a little bit. Wow. Sometimes these, this is 28 pounds and it arrives here without the outside box breaking. And I'm going to keep this out right here because I will use this tomorrow morning. You wait, there's nothing compared to that. Jill R., thank you, thank you. We, we love to get litter. Oops, now you, you be careful, honey. And this one is also from Amazon. You okay? Oh, this. This is from um, Jack Cat. Yeah. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Do the, look at this Bonito Flakes. Belly rubs for cats. Bonito Flakes. And this is what Jack Cat was telling me. Yep. Um, <laughs> I don't know if you guys saw earlier. When, what was it? One day last week. The... Uh, Connie, I think it was, brought in the the round track ball, and then inside that is the cardboard thing that the cats can uh, scratch on, and it was just tore up into just a whole bunch of pieces. It was just a mess. So there's four of them in here, and, and Jack Cat had asked me to share these with, with the Kitty City cats. And see, those guys are huge out there. They're big, and when they play, they play hard. That's where they have that really cool um, furniture that Queen of Kings heart, er, husband had made. And look at this, the heavy duty tape. You guys know I'm a big tape person. I tape everything up. Jack Cat, thank you so much um, for this. And uh, we'll make sure that Kitty City does not run out of those. And I will put this in the refrigerator because of Bella. Thank you, Jack Cat. Yeah, we'll leave the kitties play with that a minute. All right, where's my letter? Um, I'm just going to sit down so I can chat with you guys a minute. Whoops, a day. Okay, uh, I'm just going to say something real briefly because I don't think it deserves anything more than just a real brief mention. And, um, <laughs> I'm 
very good at making messes out there, aren't I? So I wanted to address something that happened today. A lot of you people know that it happened, and some of you may not know, and I'm just going to address this quickly because I truly don't believe that it deserves a lot of attention. But a while ago this afternoon, there was a Facebook page that was started by a few people who deliberately wants to be hurtful to this rescue center. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look at you guys so you know I am sincere about this. So a while ago this afternoon, there was a Facebook page that was started by a few people, and I do know who, we do know who they were, who deliberately wants to be hurtful to this rescue center. It's now off of Facebook, and it was removed probably due to a lot of our supporters who had reported it immediately. I was made aware of it, that it was there. Reddit was appalled that it was on there, and I reported them immediately to Facebook. And I was getting emails from people saying that they read it and had already reported it to Facebook also for harassment. For harassment. Screenshots was taken of this page to show Facebook themselves and to our local sheriff department that deals with internet harassment. We have a group of sheriffs here that helps us or anybody in our area um, with any kind of internet harassment and they were given a call and they also have copies of the screenshots on this. And in this letter, there were many, many untruths intending to personally hurt me and this rescue center and my family by things that was said in there. I am not going to go into details, but for those that have already read that letter, please know that I am not the kind of person that they were describing, that that was not me, that I don't have that character that they were describing, and... I, I just want people to know that I am a truthful person. I am a positive person. I always try to think of the good in, in people. And I am going to continue running this rescue center. This is what I do with my passion. And because I was given this passion, I feel from God to do what I'm doing here. And I'm blessed with the volunteers, our friends, and the supporters that we have out there. And you webcam cameras who have become such good friends of ours and I am this this rescue center will survive this we have had a lot of stuff dished out to this rescue center recently and it I have been reminded by Canton Cat and some other really good special friends that I need to keep focused on the 99% of the good people that's out there and those that 1% that is trying to cause trouble for this rescue center it, it's not going to work because we will continue what we do here. We do it because we love it. We do it because we feel there's a huge need for what we do. And we're going to continue. And I just want to tell that the supporters that I appreciate each and every single one of you. So that's all I'm going to give the attention to on what was on that Facebook. It doesn't deserve anything more than that. And it's done with. I'm over it. I'm done. And uh, I'm just ready to carry on with this rescue center.
Thank you, everybody. I read all of your 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 notes there, and I, I appreciate that. You know, I love what I do here. It's just sometimes, you know, those things get me down a little bit. I it's just over. It's done with, and we know what we need to do here, and that's what that is what is important. You know, I really love this card that Cheryl sent. And, you know, this part here, also sharing your good times and your bad times, you know, that is that is true. You know, we had talked about this, um, we had talked about this before, and I've addressed this before on, on chat, is if you're involved here, you're going to know there's there's some bad, bad times that happen, some bad things, sad things, I should say. You know, we aren't immune to... to um, kitties getting sick or coming in so hurt those things do happen so we share the good times and the bad times and and uh, we will get through this and the transparency that Cheryl talked about um, I am not a bunch of huff and puff I am who I am I don't portray to be anybody but me I don't play games with people I'm honest as honest can be and uh, I am what I am. So let me grab that. I appreciate all your, your notes you've sent. And uh, I've got a big job to clean up. Hey. No. Okay. I'm just... 